Hi and welcome back to the channel and thank you so much for clicking into this video. So in this video, I am going to teach you how to fix Ryzen Master Field to initialize in Windows 11. So make sure that you stay until the very end of this video so you don't miss any important step or information. And without further ado, let's get on that. So the first fix they can try to do is to disable Microsoft Vulnerable Driver Blocked List. So the Microsoft driver tends to block apps that it thinks harm your system. So in this case, Ryzen Master is getting blocked because of the Windows security system. So we rec recommend to disable Microsoft Vulnerable Driver Blocked List to get the security down and follow the steps right here to do the same. So do first, open the registry editor from the start menu and go to the following location right here. So you can just simply pause this video and follow this location or type this location and then right click onto the config and select new and the word. So name the newly created key with this one and just double click on it and set the value data to zero right here as shown in the photo and click the OK button. And finally, restart the computer and see if the issue is resolved. But if the problem still persists, what you can do next is to disable core, is core isolation temporarily. So if you're not willing to make changes in the registry, we can disable core insula isolation from Windows settings and when you enable core isolation and VPS environment is created, it conflicts with Ryzen Master and causes issues for the user. So remember that, dis that disabling the security feature will make the system vulnerable and follow the steps right here to disable core isolation. So hit the Windows plus S key on your keyboard and search for core isolation and open the app and go to the device security. So just turn off memory integrity and you will have to restart to confirm your actions. And finally, check if the issue is resolved. And then for the last fix for this tutorial, what we have is to reinstall graphics driver. So Ryzen Master will fail to initialize resources if the display driver is corrupted and we won't get into why driver is corrupted, but we sure we look for appropriate measures. So in order to repair the corrupted driver, we need to reinstall it and to do the same, follow the steps right here. So first, just open the device manager by pressing the window plus X key on your keyboard and go to the device manager. Expand the display adapter, right click on the display driver and simply click uninstall device. And now click on uninstall again to confirm your actions and note that keep in mind that after clicking onto the uninstall button, your screen will go black and that is a normal procedure and there is nothing to worry about. So once the screen goes back to normal, restart your computer and now now that your computer started, open Device Manager and check if the correct driver is installed. So if the correct driver is not installed, right-click on the display adapter and click on the scan for hardware changes. So in case Windows fails to install it, or install the right driver, just download it from the manufacturer's website and then install it. So that's it for this video. Those are some fixes to get you can try to do if you're having a Ryzen master field to initialize problem. So I hope this video helped you. And if it did, please make sure to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell button so you don't miss a video. Thank you so much for watching and have a great day. Bye-bye.